Alright, so if if I'm doing this correctly, I should be recording now. This is a test. Uh, I'm going to start trying to record some images. Online play. Um, uh, it'll include people uh, from, from work, uh, some of my friends, even my daughter, eventually. Um, this uh, up on probably YouTube or something of that matter. Uh, possibly even some, some live... Uh, oh, shit. B. There's a B. Uh, lot of Twitch feeds. Uh, if I get things sorted. They, they look like they shouldn't be, but... So this this game is is amazingly fun. Um, <laughs> but it, it's silly things like oh look there's a tree, so I can't I can't kill that guy because there's a tree there. But I mean if there's not a tree, get some honey. So, I mean, obviously the next test after this is uh, um, recording um, with, with others on, on Mumble with me to make sure it records what they're saying. Because uh, it's, it's not as fun, you know, if you just hear me talking shit. Headlamp. So we have down. Was back across that river where I where I was at originally in the city. That, that's the structure where I went down. This is this is our main defensive structure. If if shit starts getting bad. Oh god, I'm starving. I'm starved to death. Wait. Here. Venison stew. I'm gonna go find, go find a zombie real quick. We're gonna smash its head in. Well, hey there, sexy. Come play. Come on. So I don't, I don't know if you can hear the creaking in the background, but that's the, the zombies from the the snow area. <laughs> They're they're usually a bit tougher. And oh there he is right there. And their bones apparently always creak. There's another one. I can hear him. They 
they're lumberjacks. Of course they're tougher, right? Now I hear I hear one this way, but I think I think that the the forest in the in the snow area just makes that creaking sound too. It's just kind of freaks you out. Just like when you're in the city, like when you're over here in the city. You notice it's it's foggy. Foggy here. Across this border into the into the city area and wait for it. No, no fog. The fog's gone. What? So if you're over here in the city area, I don't know if you'll be able to hear it. Maybe if I maybe if I'm really quiet. It's not going to do it now. But usually there's whispering. Bullets! Well, bullet casings to make bullets. While I was getting this set up, there was actually multiple hordes that came and were over top of me. We built all this. It's all all us. Doing some repairs. Some some zombies got in here and started destroying my spikes. Sometimes they destroy the walls. Oh, that one's there. There we go. <laughs> Oop, there. That that's upgrading. I don't have cap iron, but that that's upgrading a, a wood wood. Lats or whatever the fuck they're supposed to be. Go hide in my hole. Hide in my hole. As you can see, we have our our chests, our food supplies, water, coffee, tea. Coffee is amazing if you're running from one place to the other. Um, not really good to drink, but if you're running, it's good. Um, Looks like some random supplies in here, actually. Mostly medical. Uh, uncooked food supplies here. Uh, berries obviously don't need to be cooked. <clears throat> eggs with, with the raw pork. Bacon and eggs. Some tallow for uh, candles or uh, torches. Ooh, there's honey. I just got honey, so we'll put that there. Bed parts. Stole most of this stuff out of a hotel that's in the city right behind me. We're going to throw that shirt in there. Because why not? Right? What else we got? Yeah. More. You never can have enough food. Some molds here for making iron ingots, uh, weapons, weapons, gunpowder, very important for making 
extra ammo. This is my daughter's chest, but um, I have her password. Gun parts. Their mining hat, like I have, gives you that lovely light. Um, so you have gas cans and, and oil barrels. Now, oil barrels, as far as I can tell, do not respawn. So, once you've used all the ones that are out there at the gas stations, you're pretty much stuck with either finding gas cans in cars or actually making fuel, um, making gas, uh, using... Uh, some other combined items such as biofuel and this green alcohol. Now back, we actually have a house and I'll show that later. Uh, this is just, this is a second city that we found. So we, we built a, uh, a safe haven, a bunker right outside the city. But at our main house, we have basically a setup um, to make and everything. I could get, I can grab some coffee. See how far away that is. See if you look at the map here. There's the original city we found, and our house is that structure right there. So this, there was, there was absolutely nothing here, uh, but a bunch of trees. We have chopped, you can see all the trees, I and mean, we've chopped all those trees down. Um, we built our walls, our house. Uh, I have my little farm building, um, with farm stuff, you know, plants and stuff. Uh, we've extended the farm, um, and then we've added our tree farm. And another tree farm here. We still have a bunch of clearing to go back here. We actually have a tunnel um, that actually we tunneled. I mean, there's massive cave under this area. And then we also have a tunnel that goes um, sort of from around here somewhere. And it kind of goes back and then over and comes out right there. Um, and then we have access to these, these three buildings. I mean, we could run, obviously, over, overground, but it's kind of a, oh, no, there's a zombie horde, let's get in the tunnel type deal. Now, on top of that, we have built this structure here in the middle of the city. This was the first of our, our little safe haven, our little, uh, buildings, like, like I'm, I'm in right now. And under it, there are tunnels, just like like in this one that I'm standing in. And then out to this area, and then down this tunnel, it goes way through. Oh, there it is. Here. And then it comes from there it, it comes all the way over to this structure which we built uh, here and it connect basically right next to this store here so you got a, a hardware store and a gun store so we have um, just tunnels that go under this city so that we can get around without the goblins obviously to us uh, there's some bookstores uh, but all in all, this this city in comparison, I know I know it looks larger than what I'm looking at right here. But we found two hardware stores, one right here and one right here, and two gun stores. And I don't I don't remember which one's which. 
Uh, but there are two gun stores here and a movie theater. Uh, a couple bookstores. So this was a really good find. It helped us out a lot. Now, it, it's kind of funny because this this was my original spawn point right here. And when I started, the guys that I was playing with, and, and you can see their name, Shadow Redeemer and uh, Pitbull Baby, um, had already been playing. And they had been playing and ran way, way north. They were looking for the edge of this map because this is the, the random generated map. And so I started out, I was like, okay, I'm going to friend you guys, I'm going to run to you. So I started, and I, I spent forever running all the way up here to these guys. Alright, so they had stopped here, and they were waiting for me. Now, when I got here, they didn't have a farm. They didn't have anything up here. They didn't have a structure. They were just, they were literally, they had sleeping bags on this side of the, on this side of the, um, the, the river here. And, and they had some coolers and stuff. And they just had boxes. And, and they were just, like, f farming stuff out through here. Metal and things like that. And some trees uh, back on this side. And I got there, and I was like... Well, I know we don't plan on staying here. We want to go find a city. But let's, you know, let's uh, get ourselves supplies so that way when we go to find the city, we'll be, we'll be good off. And so in the process, we ended up mining a bunch of iron ore and, and all kinds of things. There was just this huge deposit of iron ore, like, right in this area. And, and found that, and we ended up mining all of that out. And, or not all of it. There's still some there, honestly, if you, if you look hard enough. Um, but then I had a farm going there. And so we just got supplies, venison stew, killed some deer, you know. And we were good to go. But um, we were waiting for all three of us to be online. So throughout the time of, of us all trying to get online, we were all logging in separately and just adding to this structure and this farm and mining. While I was waiting... While I was waiting for them to get online, I was like, I'm going to go explore. I'm going to take the road and follow the road. So I did... And I found these. So we have a gas station here and a uh, bookstore. Now I'm assuming that this was actually a city. Now that I've seen the cities, now that I know what they look like, I'm assuming that this is actually a city. And had we like just explored it a little bit more, we would have found a city here. I mean, not that I'm complaining, because we found two where we're at. But we were like, oh, and we need to find a city. There's no buildings. We need stuff. So, <laughs> so we got all of our gear. We loaded up, filled our inventories, and we set our map, uh, our track, um, waypoint to uh, coordinates zero, zero. Because, you know... It said there's always going to be a, ma a city at zero zero. So we thought, well, fuck, let's. Obviously, that's where we want to go. So we we started off our original trek. We were just going to, oh, let's just follow the road. We found, um, I think this was a hotel and a, maybe a gas station or something like that. Um, and then we were like, oh, we need to get back on track. We need to get there and, and start building. We need to start doing stuff. So we had all that iron, we had all that wood that we had chopped, and, and we started trekking it. We had coffee. Coffee made so much difference. It's amazing. And I'm betting that there's, again, somewhere in this area, there's probably another city. Because this seems to be the kind of 
areas where the cities are. They're, they're just big, destroyed, monstrously destroyed areas. So, but we we just kept running, you know, because we were scared. No, we weren't really scared, but we wanted to get down here. So we found the city. So we came in. We actually came in somewhere in this area. So we came in like right here. And we seen it. We were like, oh, well, that's the city. So we were like, let's find somewhere over here to build our house. And this, this was a huge flat area. And here, well, not, apparently not flat enough because we had to, to level out a good bit of this. But it was a big flat area. So we built our city, our, our house. But we started exploring the city. Found chainsaws and augers, uh, all the good, amazing things. But then, a as things will happen, people get bored. We have to start entertaining ourselves. Places, uh, and also, since we had our basically our gun factory in here, um, we were just making ammo and making ammo and making ammo so we built some towers there's one here and there was one here but it looks like they've taken that down since I was last uh, so so what we did is we built these towers and then we went out and uh, started shooting at zombies and things all um, in this area where the map is here which you know obviously draws in zombies and so we'd have we'd have a sniper or two snipers sitting up on these towers while we had one guy um, just hiding basically behind this wall of spikes and so the snipers would come out or the the zombies would come out we were looking for the the big cop zombies because you know they have bullets and guns. Um, there were our targets. Zo so cop zombies, um, the nurse zombies, uh, and the bloated zombies. Um, so you have cops for, for bullets, guns, nurse for medication, obviously, and um, the bloated zombies for animal fat, uh, tallow for uh, the biofuel, the um, torches, the candles. So all those things. And we were just shooting them. And then we got, you know, we didn't really get bored of that. It was fun. We were like, well, let's go find some other cities because there's got to be some more. So they were like, okay, man, we're following you. Pick a random direction. So I took and I was just like, oh, all right, we're going to go this way. And I put this waypoint on the map. And sure as shit, we made it through one little area, and there was another city. Funny, because um, Shadow Redeemer actually had come, and he was in this area. He had all this area right here cleared. So had he come another, you know, little ways, he, he would have found this city a long time ago. Because he cleared all the way around this city here. But anyway, all right, well, this is enough for my test, and I'm done talking for now. Uh, enjoy.